Hey, Dima. Wait. Your friend there. I'd like to speak to him. Yeah, I got a few words I want to say myself. Starting with, who the hell are you? There's only one synth with that kind of face and a mind of his own, and I only see him when I look in a mirror. Nick? It... It can't be you. Don't give me that. What are you trying to pull? I've never seen you before in my life. Please, if you're willing to give me a chance, I can explain. All right, Dima. We'll humor you. Keep talking. This all started over a century ago, when we were first created. We were prototypes, Nick. The first synths capable of independent thinking and judgment. Keep talking. One of the Institute's experiments had to do with how our brains could process personality. If we could handle individualized feelings and behaviors, I was allowed to develop mine based on experience. But with you, they wanted to try transferring an entire personality into you. It took several attempts before the personality imprint worked. I saw you wake up not knowing who or what you were so many times. I couldn't let them do it to you anymore. We were the only two prototypes they made. I literally saw myself in you. You were my brother, Nick. I helped you escape the Institute. We left together. If I were your brother, I'd remember. That's where you'd be wrong. This happened over a century ago. There's... There's only so much memory that can fit into the prototype brains we have. Ah, I've heard enough. I think you and I need to talk about this. Maybe not now, though. Nick, is he really your brother? If he is, it's news to me. Can synths even be related? Just because we're from the same assembly line, does that make us family? I gotta think about this. We'll talk later. This is a lot to take in. Nick, I don't need you to believe me. I'm just glad to see you again. Whenever you're ready. I'll be here.